Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Motivated Results. I wanted to do a quick update video on an old product review I did quite a while ago. I believe it's almost three years ago that I originally posted this video. If you notice it, I'll post it here. Look a little bit younger. What? 30, 40 years younger? Work does that to you. That's on the uh, Chic Shake. Couldn't even say it on the first video. I won't be able to say it on this video. This product. What you're gonna notice is that the product has held up really well. For the most part, uh, you'll notice that everything looks fairly new. I mean, you'll you see a lot of layering of different stitchings from just constant use. For the most part, though, nothing major. You're gonna notice that you know it's a little dirty, a little dusty. You got some chalk on it. Uh, while we did have one concern as far as the stitching goes on the belt. Velcro. While this is something that popped up early in the use of this product, it didn't really get any worse and didn't really cause any problems whatsoever. For the most part, these are what I feel I use 80 to 90% of the time when I need wrist wraps of any sort, whether it's, whether it's bench pressing or doing curls or dumbbell overhead press or OHP with the barbell, whatever it is. This is usually what I default to only because it's such a quick and easy just in, tight, and it stays locked in for the most part. I did say that in the first review that sometimes they do tend to creep on me a little bit and they do still um, but it's not that bad the one thing i will say is that there is some damage on the interior padding so if you look at the interior of the the wrist straps there's a sort of pad there for your wrist if, if that pad wasn't there the material that the straps were made out of would actually probably cut into you what you'll notice is on some of these ends especially the ends that i would really use to torque down on the wrist strap that that foam if you will is is starting to kind of come apart but i mean for the most part besides that these are still highly functional wrist straps and function quite well to be honest with you these are you know three years in for moderate to heavy usage and so for the most part this is freaking surprising that these are handling the damage and, and wear and tear so well uh, once again very inexpensive product i think to this day they're still sitting at about 20 dollars and uh, still a product i recommend to people once again, no affiliation with this company. Don't know anything about them besides this product I purchased. If you guys wanna see the original review, I'll post it down below. But overall, great product. I'm really, really surprised at how well these are holding up. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this quickie update. If you guys wanna see more product reviews, I put everything in playlists on this channel, so you're gonna notice. I'll link down the playlist below, and uh, you'll notice everything from supplements to products to just you know things like food scales. So questions, comments, post them down below. Let's do this. For those of you that are still watching right now, screenshot this video, post it on your Instagram, tag MR wrist wraps, that way I can find it. Tag me on it, and I'll pick a winner and send them out some, some goodies. See you guys next time.